Now this is a great example of a violation of the workspaces required in section 110.26A. Uh, section A1 requires three feet of depth in front of this equipment and as you can see we've got this water pipe here, water meter. I don't even know if you can open that cover with the way this piping is positioned. You certainly can't open it 90 degrees. And then as we look up, we will see there's no headroom. The headroom, according to 110.26A3, has to be at least as high as the equipment, six and a half feet minimum, or at least, at least as high as the equipment. But as you can see, this ductwork is right in the way. That's going to make it really difficult to work on this equipment safely. So we have no headroom for this panel board, no headroom for this equipment, and no depth. This is Russell LeBlanc, NEC consultant for ECNM Magazine.